Welcome to the Video Dictionary. On January 9th, 2018, Carl Benjamin, a YouTuber who goes by the screen name Sargon of Akkad, released a video entitled 2018, What We Can Do. In this video, he proposed a word, a label, for a movement he believes may change the course of the political discussion. That word is liberalist, noun, an activist for liberty and classical liberal principles. History and etymology. The first time the word liberal was used in English in a political context was in 1801, and it was used as a negative label for those people who supported expanding political freedoms. Over time, the term came to represent free markets, liberty, freedom of expression, and much more. Lately in the United States, the meaning has expanded in such a way that it almost precludes the older meaning of the word. This new definition includes using government power to affect social change, a practice that tends to lead towards the opposite of liberty. It can cause undue burdens to be placed upon some citizens in favor of others. This is one of the many reasons I and many others believe a new word is needed to separate real liberalism from what's quickly becoming a Marxist socialist movement. Over the course of the past couple years, a community has arisen around these concepts of freedom and liberty, and they began voicing their views through alternative media like YouTube. Some of them would systematically deconstruct the arguments for authoritarianism. Others would simply make fun of these people who want to take away your liberty. Either way, they were voicing their opposition to this growing authoritarianism disguising itself as liberalism. This is where that video Carl Benjamin released comes in. He proposed a word for those people who promote liberty and rally behind it. It's not the prettiest word, but it is growing on me. Liberalist. This word wasn't a new coinage, but this word struck me as the perfect word to start a movement. And it's the ist suffix at the end of the word that I really like. The ist suffix is used to make a word into a noun with the meaning of one who does or makes. It can also indicate the adherence to an ideal or an ideology. And the combination of those two makes it perfect. Based on its parts, the word liberalist means one who makes liberty. That's exactly what we need more of in this world. People making liberty. Prescription and commentary. Now, as I said before, I really like what this word means. And the list of liberalist principles that Sargon has put together on his website really get me excited, including things like individual rights, economic freedom, freedom of speech, self-reliance, blind justice, and secularism. Now, as someone who's attracted to the voluntarist ideology or the voluntarist philosophy, some of the policy prescriptions that are put forward in some of the streams I have some qualms with, but overall, if we're going to take the discussion of politics in the direction of these principles that I just listed, I'm willing to set aside some of my more extreme beliefs about the nature of government if I can get the political discussion going in the right direction. I would proudly stand side by side with a liberalist and fight for liberty. I don't know if I can call myself a liberalist yet, but I think it's a movement headed in the right direction, and most importantly, I just love the word. Thank you for watching. I've linked to Sargon's original video in the description below, as well as liberalist.org, where you can find a listing of principles, frequently asked questions, and more. You can follow the link in the description to the blog entry for this word, where I'll post other links for more information. And until next time, keep on learning. I recommend we choose a label and stick with it. If someone who promotes feminism is a feminist, and someone who promotes socialism is a socialist, and someone who promotes Islamism is an Islamist, and someone who promotes fascism is a fascist, then someone who promotes liberalism must be a liberalist. I say that we use this label until it's dead or we find something better. Would you like to know more?